What's up guys and welcome and welcome back to my channel. Today I'll be checking out New Jeans Supernatural Dance Practices. All three versions that they dropped today. Um, some people might say it's overkill to check out all three because it's the same choreo and the same dance. But I don't think so because first of all it's different uh, it's different like ways of filming this uh, which is always interesting. But um, also I'm like I love the choreo so much. I want to see it as much as I can. So I'm going to be checking out all three uh, versions. Um, that being said, disclaimer, I've, I know the choreo already, um, mostly from uh, the MVs, the MV scenes in the MV, but also live stages that I checked out um, on my Patreon, by the way, if anyone's interested. Um, together with a bunch of other New Jeans reactions on my Patreon, I, I think I have about 50 videos now, 50 New Jeans reactions on my Patreon alone. So yeah, if you're interested in that, uh, feel free to head over. But um, yeah, I've watched a, a few live stages of, of Supernatural on my on my Patreon. so. I've seen the choreo, but I actually never saw. I've never seen it in like a fixed version, which we're gonna get to. Yeah, like where where I see the full choreo. Um, I think I don't think I've ever seen that because in the live stages they also always zoom in and all that stuff. So this is still gonna be there's st still gonna be new stuff for me in these three videos. Um, and also there's probably moves I've missed before, and it's always nice to see dance practices. So yeah, long intro I know, but. Yeah, let's jump into it. This is the order they were released in. So uh, the normal one, then the handheld one, and then the fixed version. So let's go. Let's start with the normal one. Let's go. Uh, 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 uh. Hold, on, hold on. Okay, I was adjusting the volume. Can't do that. <laughs> uh, the new jeans uh, shirt. Shirts. Nah, bro, I love this already. The fact that we can hear them laughing and all that stuff. I always say that, but it's so cool with new jeans. They always have so much fun. Whether they're on stage or doing dance practices. Okay, honey with the bum. Okay, they, they're doing it with the microphones. Bro, the choreo is so cool. Like, it's so different from what they've done before as well. Because it's like old school hip hop more and like... A lot of these extension arm moves and all that stuff, it's so cool. Hey! I love that move a lot, I always say that when I reacted to it. That move, like tuck tuck, that wave, I don't know, it's so crispy, it's so clean. Oh, also, of course, Hayen is here. I wanted to say that in the, in the intro as well. I'm assuming they are, they, yeah, they probably waited for Hayen to recover before filming this, which I really like because um, this is a five-person choreography, you know, uh, so it makes makes sense that they waited for her. But also, yeah, they could have potentially just released a four-member version or one with the bunny, with the um, choreographer. Uh, but I like that they waited for Hayen because we need all five members. Hey, 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 hey. Look at the smiles. Also, this choreo is super hard. Especially, I'm gonna point out the part that I think is super hard. Because I tried dancing it, uh, learning it a little bit. It's a workout, let me tell you. Damn bro. Helen is really feeling it. Like, she's, like, she has so much, like, I don't know, so much energy. But I also said that in like my live stage reactions, um, over the past like few comebacks, Hedin has grown so much when it comes to stage presence and like facial expressions, energy on stage. Not that the, not that she was ever bad, but I think you can clearly see like how how much better she got over the years. Everyone got better, but Hedin I think has the most like I don't know. Hey! Oh, I messed up. Oh man, I messed up again. Whatever. Also, super like simple outfits. Hanging with the bandana though. This part. Hold on, hold on. Okay. I tried to learn this entire part, like from this, from the, from this chorus on. Hold on. Right here. Like this chorus part, and then the dance back after that. Let me tell you, the dance back is so hard in my opinion because it's so much like jumping around and like so much like it's energy wise it's so hard like i was sweating like crazy when i tried this the microphones okay all good hey hey 
the cheers on the dancers. Hey, no, bro, this is so sick. The way they make eye contact with the camera and the energy, yeah, the energy is crazy. That's so good to see. See Hey and do the choreo too. And they keep going. Woo! The cheers. Hold on. What's happening? Wait, I need to. I don't know. Hold on, why did why did Minzy and Payan do this? Was that always part of the choreo? Hey! Bro, look at the swagger, man. Mics, because I've seen a few instances already when they when they kind of messed up at the end with putting the mic on the mic stand, um, and it fell down or they couldn't do it in time because they have to do it pretty fast, you know. Because especially especially in the in the one for the for the dance break part, even more so, and um, because they have to like put the mic on the mic stand and then get right into the dance break. And if you don't, if you kind of mess up putting the mic on the mic stand. You gotta, I think Minji, it happened to Minji once that she had to, you know, carry the mic into the dance break. And I think Danielle once, um, it fell, like the mic fell down at the end uh, when she wanted to put it on the mic stand. But yeah, let's get into the handheld version. Let's go. So, you know, someone, someone was in action. Okay. Different hairstyle for heading. Woo! <laughs> Like this is so different, like the vibe of this way of filming. Like way more personal, I'd say. Obviously, because it's way closer. But the downside to this is obviously that we don't see all the footwork. And the other and all the members. Also a lot of little groups that they're building with the dancers too. This move is also so swag. Like I've never, I don't know. It's just a cool move. This, this, this right here. Hey, hey. Also, bro, their shirts are glowing. I feel like there's like some type of color correction on on the video. It's like so bright. Everything, even the white is so bright. <laughs> I bro, no, I'm just so happy Hey, this year, I swear to god. Ooh, I didn't even realize that in the last one. Minji just going backwards into the next part. Uh. Bro, it's so, the dance is so sick. Like, I'm gonna keep saying that until I die. Stop stopping. And I, they they use a lot of stage uh, as well in the in the in the choreo, um, or just yeah a lot of movements uh, to the right to the left like within like the choreo itself like not just walking to the sides but also you know they're moving as as five people or with the with the backup dancers, um they're moving a ton through, through, uh, on the stage so they're like they it's great stage management I guess you could say, and um, that they try to use the full full stage hey uh, also i gotta say i think minji is my favorite when it comes to this kick move she has like also in the mv like i already i don't know if i mentioned that in the mv i don't think i don't think so um but like that kick move that they do in the beginning uh for like this part uh, and the and the leg kicks she has like there's some something about the way minji does that move that's so like powerful and like so 
like clean but powerful but like swaggy at, like she's she's just nice with it those kicks da, da. actually not that much here but i realized like in other stages on other stages also in the mv she's she's kicking the air bro like she's going in Like right here, how far? Especially Minji has to be so fast. She gets to the mic stand last, has to put it in, and like right into the into the choreo. Like that's that's you gotta you know. Hey, that's oh, I love this. Ooh, the perspective from down there is nice. But yeah, I love love the cheering. From the members themselves, but also especially from the backup dancers. Like the footwork is also not easy. I was saying go new jeans. At least that's what I'm hearing. Not sure though. Ah. Yeah, this like type of um, handheld version is obviously the most, the closest to the stage versions, and I really love it. Though I always say, you know, I like the fixed versions to, to see everything, but like this is equally as good to have like more personality and more, you know, close. I don't know. It's so nice to have like close-ups as well, of course. Bro, the <laughs> the mood switch in Honey's facial expressions. Like, cool, then happy and cute, and then cool again. <laughs> Damn. Bam, 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 bam. Hey. Okay. Last version. Let's go. Oh, I really like the fixed version. So, wait. Wait, I didn't even. No, no, no. Hold on, hold on. This was just. Okay, not handheld, but still moving. Like, like okay, a moving version. And this is the. This is the, um, I didn't even pay attention to it in the first one. <laughs> but yeah, the first one was the moving version, the normal moving moving version. The second one was the handheld. Now the fix. Now we, yeah, I think each dance practice, and I love that they put out multiple ones because each one has like their own charms and their own, like also place, just, you know? <laughs> every, every version has a right to exist in my opinion because we see different things. Like right here already. I don't think I either haven't paid attention to it or didn't pay attention to it or I haven't seen it in the other ones. But like the uh, yeah, Hey and Head and and Minji are all stopping on the same beat and while doing the choreo, Ta. and like focus on Danielle and Honey and then they get back into it. And the formations, obviously, we can see them way better in the fixed version. Bro, these these leg movements also like it's nothing crazy, but the just the there's so much swagger behind those moves. Again, Hayden and Hayden this time freeze together with the backup dancers. Oh, and they don't even come in at the same time. Hayden comes in first. Oh, because it's okay, because it's her verse. But yeah, the other members, while well, Hedin is doing her thing, the other members are basically doing the same choreo, always with different vibes, which is always also like a new jeans thing for sure, that they have like personalities in their dancing as well, and they, they, they are not forced to dance the exact same way. Uh, they've always done that though, so that's nothing new, but I always still like to point it out because it's, I don't know, it's still, I think it's still pretty special in, in K pop, I'd say. I mean, there's multiple groups doing that, but like, um, I think, yeah, New Jeans, at least from what I feel like they, they kind of, they weren't necessarily the first to do it, but they've been the first to do it like every single time, I think. Um, but yeah, so they're, they're doing the same choreo, different directions though, different vibes to the movements. Hey. And then synchronization again. There's always a nice mixture between like very synchronized moves in Newton's choreos 
and then also individualism. Is that a word? I think so. <sighs> Bro, I love to see this, man. Look at Minji. Minji and Hayden look ahead and looking at each other, and Minji just smile, man. Ah. Uh, it's so fun to watch them have fun. Now they're just vibing in the back, kind of, you know, waiting for their turn. This time they didn't do choreo. Uh, I mean, they kind of did. Honey kind of did some moves, but like it wasn't part of the choreo. They were just probably supposed to wait for their turn and just vibe in the background especially probably also because they are they're kind of um the dancers are in between minji and 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 the other members so on stage you don't really pay attention in the first place to the other members and so they don't have to do choreo first of all because minji is like way further like way more in the front but also because there's like stuff happening like there's there's people running on stage so you don't pay attention to the other members which is probably why um, they they don't have to do the choreo there to for everything to look good because no one really pays attention to that in this in this um, moment uh, anyways. But they're still obviously you know that you can see like them them still vibing the music so they're not just standing there and waiting obviously. This move is so offbeat. It always like throws me off. Like she, dun dun, but. It, it's not on like second chance, like not one hit on second chance. It's like, it's different, right? Why am I tripping? Yeah, it's like second, like it's it's in between the beats too. It's, it's so, it always threw me off every time I saw it. Yeah, it's so interesting. Head isolation. Ooh. Oh, bro, that traveling was nice. Like with the flow, like especially Helen and Honey going to the to the to their right with the flow. That was that looked super clean. Hold on, I want to see. I want to compare real quick. Yeah, I feel like in the, in the dance practices. Sorry. Oh, one time. Yeah, in the dance practices, she, I think Minji is still my favorite when it comes to that move. But like, she she hit she hit those uh, kicks even harder in the in the mv version and and maybe even like i think even the live stages that i've seen um so yeah Helen is so clean. Like her footwork has always been like probably my favorite in, in new jeans, like footwork wise. But like she's like her her angles for that, like for that when they turn to the front right here for this. Like she is so clean. These moves are sick too. Like the da, da, da. That, that, like the kind of like slight stop in be in the movement on beat. I'm kind of I'm actually kind of confused why they why they. I mean, it's it's obviously on purpose. Like Danielle and Helen are really like vibing and really dancing, 
and like Minzy and Hayen are like more on the sidelines, like watching and that they're doing this again, or Hayen did this again, which like to me feels like I remember when they did the um the dance battles for, for Bunny's camp, the first Bunny's camp um in, in Korea and so um they did like obviously the dance off again like in groups and like that's like kind of what they did there or what people do, you know, when, when there's like a dance off but a friendly dance off, they kinda, you know, boo boo the other team. And that's kind of what I what I what I'm getting from here, but I don't know why they're doing this here. Like, yeah, they yeah, Helen and Danielle Danielle have their own like full choreo for this part, and like Minji and Hayne don't. It's so interesting. Yeah, I love this too. Like leaning. The entire group. Oh, oh yeah, that also the like they kind of activate, uh, not not at the same time. So Honey and Minzy, after the stop, they uh, go into into the next move that, uh, instantly, and and Hedden and Danielle are waiting for the next beat. Let's go. Yeah, man, I love this choreo. I still, I'm not sure which one is my favorite at the moment. And because How Sweet was definitely my favorite, like, not by far necessarily, because I really like, honestly, I really like all of the choreos. Um, there was a time when New Jeans, New Jeans was my favorite choreo, like from the Get Up um, album. Before that, OMG was my favorite. And, and yeah, but from the recent ones, like when How Sweet came out, like that choreo is like so my style. So I I probably still say that one is my favorite right now. But like Supernatural is like is super close. Like it's yeah I don't know. There's something about the Supernatural choreo which is like first of all of course like nostalgic feelings with the with the old school hip hop and different different genres in there. Um, but I don't know what it is. But it's like something about this choreo is so nice. But I. I I'm not sure. Like it's either how sweet and and supernatural at the moment. Like it's kind of tied for my favorite choreo, and I'm not sure. But yeah, I just love both of them. I love all of their choreos. Um, and yeah, also I'm I'm planning on checking out some of their Korean um live stages for for supernatural as well because the ones that I've watched were the Japanese ones when they were on Japanese music shows. Um, and I also didn't know back then that they were gonna do like a Korean version and uh, go on Korean uh, shows uh, with supernatural as well. Um, so yeah, my plan right now is to check out like at some point soon, check out uh, some of their live stages for Supernatural in Korea, and right now um, in, in on the Korean shows as well. Um, so if you're interested in that, um, I'll, I'll be doing that on Patreon as well, uh, just like all of my live stages. So yeah, I don't know if we're gonna get like uh, dance practices for for right now as well, and for maybe for house for like maybe for all four of the songs, um, with five members because. Yeah, I, I could see that happening because, you know, as I said, they were probably waiting for Hayne to recover, to fully recover, to dance again. And now they came out with the Supernatural dance practice. So I can honestly see, or I could see them putting out the dance practice for How Sweet, Bubblegum, and right now as well, now that Hayne is back. Um, so yeah, but we'll see. Maybe, maybe not though. Um, but if they do, I'll be checking out all of those as well, even though I know all of the choreos too. Uh, but, you know, as I said in the beginning, I love all of the choreos, so I can't wait to see you know, as much as I can. Wait, what? I, I don't know that, if that made sense, but um, I want to see as much of the choreos as I can. So I'll be checking out all the other dance practices if they're going to come out with more. Uh, but yeah, really enjoyed these three. Um, as I said, different vibes, which is why I checked out all of them. Um, and yeah, really enjoyed this. Hope you guys enjoyed my reaction as well. If you did, feel free to leave a like and maybe also consider subscribing. And with that being said, thank you guys so much for watching as always. And hopefully I'll see you in the next video. Until then, peace.